guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a really exciting video. I have a Zaffle and Shein haul. I always am wondering how the fit and the quality and if these bathing suits actually look the same online as they do in person. So I will be rating every single bathing suit out of five stars just to let you know how I think about the quality and the fit. And I will also be trying everything on so you get to see every single piece on my body and see how it looks and see if it's something you would want. I will be linking every single piece down below. So if you want to watch this Zaffle and Shein haul and see how I feel about all of these pieces, then just keep watching. So first, starting off with Zaffle. Um, all of Zaffle's bikinis come in these really cute Ziploc bags. And I think they're really perfect if you want to travel and put travel size minis in it. Um, so they won't leak anywhere. I really like these bags, so I'm probably going to keep them all. But the first bathing suit I got is this bikini here. And it has a denim trim on it. A ruffle all around, even in the back. And just letting you know, all of Zaffle's bikinis are super cheeky, <laughs> but I think it's pretty much like all of them on all the sites, um, Zaffle and Shein, but they definitely do have some that are more full coverage, but none that I was really interested in. Just putting it out there. And the top looks like this. And it has that same kind of embroidered trim and then the denim frill at the bottom. It's just like a triangle cup. Um, so for this one, it definitely looks exactly like it does online, and it fits really nice. I would say it's a little snug, so if I were you, I'd size up, and I really do think the material's not bad. Um, it could be a little bit better, definitely on the white part. Um, I do like how the top is double lined, so I don't think you'll see anything through it. Um, the bottoms definitely aren't, so I'd be a little bit worried going in the ocean. So I think I'd give this one three and a half stars. Next I have this lavender bikini, and it's one shoulder. It's really cute, and it has a lace-up detailing on the side, and I think this will look so good with a tan. And the bottoms are just standard bottoms. Once again, on the cheekier side. And I would give this bikini a definite four out of five stars. I think it's really cute. The top is a little bit big on me. I think I'd wear it more to like a pool party to like lay out in or something or look super cute. I don't think I'd really wear it to the beach where the waves are hitting me. Um, the bottoms fit perfectly though. And the material is super nice and really thick. You definitely aren't going to see anything. Um, no butt cracks, no, no boobs. <laughs> but I think it looks really good on. And it does look exactly like the picture on the website. So I'm really happy with that. The next bathing suit I have is this brownie nude one. And it ties in the front. So this one did have padding in it, but I took it out. The padding is lumpy, like literal lumps in it. So I couldn't deal with that. But personally, I don't really care if there's padding in my bathing suit or not. It doesn't really bother me. Um, maybe if you have bigger boobs, you might care. I'm not sure, but my boobs are pretty tiny, so I don't care. Um, and the bottoms are just standard bottoms. They look like the other ones. They are definitely cheeky once again. And they go up on the sides, which I really like because it helps suck you in. But for this one, um, the material's not bad. I really like how it's ribbed, so you're not going to see anything through it. Uh, and the bottoms are definitely super thick and double lined, so I really like that. And I think the quality's really good. The look's really good. Um, so I'd actually give this one a 5 out of 5. I really enjoy it a lot. The next bathing suit I have from Zaffle is this checkered one. And this one is really cool because it has straps, but you could actually take them off if you don't want them. Um, which I probably will take them off because they are a bit annoying. The, because it has that little clasp there on it, they just unhook so easily and... I don't know, that would annoy me way too much, so I'm probably just gonna take them off. And the bottoms are tie bottoms, which I'm honestly not that big of a fan of. I do like how they adjust, but I just, I don't know, I'm not a fan of the look anymore. 
but it is a really great quality bathing suit it's super thick you're not going to see anything through it the bottom's double lined and it looks exactly like it does on the website which is so good and, and that's like the number one thing i was nervous about so i'm so happy that you know it it looks exactly like it does on the website and this one i would probably give a four and a half because it's almost perfect but this is all per personal preference. I really just don't like the tie sides as much as I thought I would. And, you know, if you did want to wear the straps, it, it's very annoying, to be honest. They just kind of, like, fling off. So, yeah, so that's for that one. The next Apple bikini I have is my all-time favorite bikini. This is the cutest bikini on. If you get anything from this whole entire haul, please get this bikini. I'm telling you. So it's this bubblegum pink ribbed bandeau top bikini and it ties in the back so it's adjustable and it is the most gorgeous Barbie bubblegum pink color you've ever seen. I'm obsessed with it. And then the bottoms are just super standard and they look like this. Um, they go higher on the hips as well and they're also ribbed and I think it's so cute. It looks exactly like it looks online. The ribbed material makes it so you can't see anything through. Um, there is padding in the top, which I don't mind. It looks good. It doesn't get all crinkled in there, which I hate when bathing suits do that. When you like see the padding like folding in. It looks so good on. And this I would definitely give a 5 out of 5 stars. I'm obsessed with it. I also got that same pink bikini in red. And it's the same exact thing, the same exact material and it crisscrosses in the back and ties and the bottoms look the exact same. Um, I wish I got every single color in this style bikini because I like it that much. So also five out of five stars, obsessed with this one. Um, yeah, and you'll see in the try on, it looks so good on. The next apple bikini I got is this pink and blue palm leaf one. And it has little leopards on it. It's so cute. It ties at the top where the arms are. And I really like this style of bikini. I think that there, I think it's uh, Lolly and Layla or something. It, it's like a style, a brand of bikinis. And I believe that they're like around $80 for the top and $80 for the bottom. So if you want a replica of that bikini, please go to Zaffle and get it because this looks so cute. The material is amazing, it's super thick, and it looks exactly the same as that bathing suit. And the bottoms, you'll see kind of like a trend here, they all look the same. So they go up on the sides, just a cheeky standard bottom, and they look so cute on. And I love the little bows on the top, it's super girly. And I definitely give this bikini a 5 out of 5. The material is amazing. You're not going to see anything through it. And it looks exactly the same online as it does in my hands right now. The next bikini I got is this hot pink one. And it ties in the center. I think this one is so cute. And I just love hot pink in the summer and on a tan. It just looks so good. So I really like this one. And the bottoms look like this. They're kind of like a straight across bottom. They're not really my favorite, to be honest. And I would say that the bottoms are a little bit smaller and more snug on me than the rest of the bottoms. They just don't have that much of a stretch, you know? Um, I'm not really that big of, the, of a fan of the bottoms, but I would always wear this with like a different bottom. So just because of the bottoms and how annoying they are, I'm gonna have to give this one a four out of five but I do overall really like it. It is, the top is super thick and I really like the material, as whereas the bottoms are kind of like a different material and they're not as thick and double lined. They're just single lined and I'm just not a big fan, but I don't mind because of the price of the bathing suits, just wearing the top with like a different bottom. So yeah, definitely four to five stars for this one. Right. So one of my favorites and the last Zaffle bikini is kind of like the pink and blue palm leaf one. It has the same kind of straps on it. It's a little twisted. There we go. Um, it has the same straps on it, on it, and this one is reversible, which is so cool. So we have this like white and black marble print on this side, and then when you turn it inside out, 
you have this star print, which I really enjoy the star print side. I think it looks so cool and trendy. And I love the bows on top so it's adjustable on your straps. And you could also wear it off the shoulder or you could just take them off your arms and wear it as a bandeau when you're tanning so you don't, so you don't get tan lines. But I really am obsessed with this one and the material is super thick. It looks exactly like it does online. And I love the fit of the bottoms. They look like this and they go up on the sides like the other ones um, and they look really good on so I really like this one as well. So I definitely give this one a 5 out of 5 stars. It's my all time favorite one along with the bandeau one. I really do enjoy this. Now going on to my Shein bathing suits. I only got two of them um, but the two I got I do really enjoy. So the first one is this Tula Rosa dupe so it's a brand on Revolve and they have bathing suits like this so it looks like this it has like a chevron pattern and it has little tassels on the bottom which I think is so cute and the bottoms look like this they're high waisted and they have little tassels on it I think this one looks so cute um, the bottoms are double lined I could feel in there and they're super thick and when I stretch them out I can't see anything through and the bottom, I mean the tops do have padding in it, but it does have a slot where you could take it out if you prefer to have it out. And I think this one is really cute. The fit is very nice. The only problem I have is the bottoms are a little big for me, which is weird because the top fits fine, but I guess I could always size down. Um, so if I think if I size down, the bottoms would fit a lot better. But I think overall it's really cute. Um, I would definitely give this one a three and a half stars only because you'll see in the try on the bottoms kind of look a little bit like a diaper. I, I'm not going to lie just because they're big you have to be super careful with like high waisted things because I think they could go south really quick. So The very last bikini I have is this one that has the ties on the top again. As you can see I'm obsessed with it. Um, it has little toucans on it, parrots, I'm not sure honestly, <laughs> you're probably going to call me dumb down in the comments but that's okay, I don't know my birds and I think it looks so good on, I love the bright colors and it looks exactly like it does online which makes me so 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 happy and the bottoms are the standard bottoms that I like but the only problem with these are they are a lot cheekier than I thought like super cheeky thong <laughs> bottoms but I can't lie the material is amazing I love the look of it um, the only thing is I don't know about these bottoms I might just wear normal black bottoms with this top um, but I can't lie the material is great uh, the look is great and I really like the fit of it so that one's that and I give this one five stars I really do enjoy it Alright guys, so that concludes my Zaffle and Shein haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed and decided if it's worth it for you guys to buy. And if you want to see my face again, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It would help me out a ton. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye! I just had to let you know you're